Hello children it's a long time since we have met have you heard about tenses i'm sure you must have heard about it from the lower classes itself what is a tense a tense describes the time of action what is the action word in english yes of course it is the verb so we can say that tense is related to the verb so i will tell you one example if you say i am eating what does that mean it means that at the present moment at the moment of speaking you are eating right if you say i ate that means that action had taken place in the past it is over if you say i will eat it means that the action is about to take place in the future it will take place in the future so that is how we can identify what tense the sentence is in from the verb so we can say the tense is linked to the verb in english there are mainly three tenses what are the present tense past tense and future tense again these three tenses are divided into four each for example present tense is divided into simple present tense present continuous tense present perfect tense and present perfect continuous tense past is again divided into simple past past continuous past perfect past perfect continuous similarly future is also divided into simple future future continuous future perfect and future perfect continuous so all together how many tenses are the yes 12 tenses are the okay so in english we have mainly 12 types of tenses hope this is clear to you children so now we will study where we have to use different tenses and what is the form of those tenses each tense has to be written in a particular form so what is that we will learn in the next module right